Magical Gathering. <laughs> Isn't Father Cornello amazing? Well, he's an amazing performer, I'll give him that. But those aren't miracles. He's swindling you. <laughs> but he's ignoring the laws. Yeah, that's what's bugging me. For that holy bastard to be using that kind of alchemy. I'm telling you, it isn't alchemy! Why won't either of you believe that we're seeing true miracles? Brother, could it be? I ain't gonna lie, buddy boy in the back got socks on, bro. <laughs> he ain't got those shoes. And he got his arms crawled with the socks. That's how you coming out, my boy? That's tough. method of deconstructing and recreating matter by understanding its inherent laws and its place in nature. The power to freely transform matter may appear as a miracle to those unfamiliar with the practice. But even the seemingly almighty power of alchemy must abide by one absolute law. That law is equivalent exchange. In order to gain something, an equivalent price must be paid. Numerous alchemists neglected or intentionally broke this law many times in the past. it invariably led to tragedy. Five thousand years ago, there existed a civilization in the East which flourished through the power of alchemy. giant cities cultivate the land and protect the citizens from invaders. The people both revered and feared the miracles performed by their king. But then, one day, tragedy befell them. forbidden act. And as a consequence, a terrible catastrophe struck the land. The civilization is said to have perished in a single night. An act that cost the older brother his left leg and the younger his entire body. On impulse, the older transmuted the younger soul and bound it to a suit of armor, sacrificing his right arm. giant suit of armor. Even now, the brother 
are said to be on a continuing journey in search of the legendary Philosopher's Stone. The only item that may help them regain their bodies and bring back everything they lost. Looks like we're finally here, the desert city of Lior. The folks around here seem a little different from the people in other towns. Well, I hear most of the town's people are followers of the sun god Leto. Sounds like a cult if you ask me. So, about those miracles that are being performed by their prophet. Right, based on the rumors I've heard, all that stuff is just alchemy. But even then, being able to resurrect the dead seems a little far-fetched. You figure it's got something to do with the Philosopher's Stone? Well, that's what we came all the way here to find out, isn't it? For starters, we should try meeting up with this so-called prophet. Oh shit, here we go, man. Got the analog stick. Extra job. Okay. Hold on. Alright, first things first. Let me. This shit is crazy loud on, on my end. Hold on. I gotta put this shit all the way down. Alright, let's get back. Let's get back in here. Hi, my people. Welcome to a brand new old school walkthrough. Today we're playing Full Metal Alchemist 2, Curse of the Crimson Elixir. Let's get into it, man. Alright, we got the controls actually. Okay, square attack. Okay, R2 to the eyes counter. Okay, the eyes counter attack. Oh, what the fuck? Let me do that. Something wrong? Nah, it's just my stomach's growling. Let's grab a bite to eat here. Show. No one's laughing. Who the heck is that? Why, well, that's Father Cornello. Who's that? You're kidding me! You've never heard of the great prophet Cornello? He performs miracles. I've never seen anything like it before. It's God's work for sure. Father Cornello the Prophet, huh? So, mister, how can I get an audience with this guy? He's 
is always in the temple. Just head straight down this street and you're there. The Temple of the Sun God. Well, no use sitting around with that information. Al, you ready to split? Uh-huh. Up and at him. Bust a lung, Grandpa. We can fix it. It's in a thousand pieces. Okay, here goes. Whoa! Huh? What? Is that good enough for you? Well, I'll be damned. It's really a land of prophets. Your buddy can work miracles like Cornello. Oh, it's nothing like that. It's science. We're alchemists. We're the Elric brothers. Not to brag or anything, but we're pretty well known. <laughs> Elric, huh? Oh, the Elric brothers. Oh, I've heard of you guys before. The older brother is the state alchemist. Full metal alchemist, Edward Elric. So you're the master alchemist, and now I get why you're called full metal. It's because of this suit of armor. Um, it's not me, it's him. Huh? You mean that little shorty? Elric, the younger brother. And I am the full metal alchemist, Edward Elric. Uh, so sorry. Uneducated, no good, run. Come on, Al. Let's get out to the temple. Yeah, sorry for the ruckus. Bye. The Alchemist, Edward Elric. I feel like I'm playing a DS game. What the fuck? Have you started with R1? The right analog stick. Examine your surroundings. Press R1 to reset the camera. So it's default position. Okay.
down this street to the temple and we'll be shaking hands with the prophet Cornello. Hey, it looks like there's some sort of gathering up ahead. Are they waiting for us? You, you're the state alchemist, Edward Elric, aren't you? So what if I am? Who wants to know? I don't do autographs. Visiting Father Cornello won't be possible, I'm afraid. For your souls are destined to depart for the afterlife. Right here and now. Is that a fancy way of telling us your... It is the will of Leto. Nothing personal. I'd say your god's got some aggressive tendencies, but if it's a fight you want, I'm happy to oblige! What? Wait, Ed. If beating up psycho cultists is wrong, then I don't want to be right! Come on, Al! Accessories, we gotta figure out the best items in the game. A lot of shit doing this. Business district, I'm a Seems like ultimates.
They're thrashing us. They're defying the heavens. Get more men. These heretics must not live. So is the will of Leto. Kill them. I don't know about you, Al, but I think these guys have been out in the desert way too long. Ah, come on already. I'll give you guys points for tenacity, but your fighting skills suck. Ah, don't listen to their blasphemy. Get them. What are you doing? Hmm? <sighs> what a time to run into Rose. How could you all gang up on them? You've turned into a mob. Uh Watch out, miss. You shouldn't get so close. Repent before Leto punishes you all for your sins. What the fuck? Uh, bad timing. We'll let these blackguards go for now. 
Retreat! Wait! Where are you going? We're not through here! Don't you have even one word of apology to these gentlemen? Wait, I said! Um, it's okay. Thank you. We're all right. Some welcome wagon you guys have. All they were giving out were free trips to the hospital. I don't know, none of these people I have not watched the show. Only watched like one episode, and that was like five years ago. I ain't gonna lie. They were obviously worshippers of Lita. They did ask if you were a state alchemist. Could that be why they ganged up on us? What do they have against state alchemists? Is it in the teachings of Leto to pick fights with strangers? You mean they jumped you? Th that can't be. Believe it, sister. So is the will of Leto, they said. Easily riled God, huh? That's impossible. Our prophet, Father Cornello, couldn't possibly allow it. <laughs> they may have been ordered by your so-called prophet, for all I know. Yeah, from the way they were talking, that's what it sounded like. Please, stop with this nonsense! Father Cornello is a venerable man who taught us, the unlearned, of God's ways. Violence is not in Leto's teachings. He might as well preach to a brick wall. We're not believers. In that case, why don't you come to our gathering? It's at the temple up ahead. Then you should be able to see how truly wonderful Father Cornello and the teachings of Leto really are. And will Father Cornello be at this gathering? Of course. Huh. In that case, maybe I'll take your invitation and check it out. That's wonderful! Oh, my name is Rose. I'm Alphonse Elric, and this is my older brother, Edward Elric. Oh, you both have such beautiful names. Please, come this way. I'll take you to the temple. Oh, that could have been a thumbnail. Oh my god, what the fuck? So they're all believers in Lido, huh? Dude, this shit glitching, bro. Like, what the fuck? That's right. This alone is a testament to the greatness of the Bro, why is it glitching? Bro, why is it doing that? How wonderful it is to worship God and live every day with gratitude and hope. If you show him you're faithful, I bet he could make you taller. And what did you say? There, there. She didn't mean any harm. Oh, there he is! Father Cornello is about to perform his miracles. Children of God who live upon this land, pray in faith that ye may be saved. I am thy father and the sun god's commissary. Oh, I get it. So I guess those are the miracles. What do you think? Well, it looks pretty obvious. He's using alchemy. It's just like you said. Exactly. But still, something's wrong. So, how are you liking your first miracle gathering? <laughs> Isn't Father Cornello amazing? Well, 
he's an amazing performer, I'll give him that. But those aren't miracles. He's swindling you. But he's ignoring the laws. Yeah, that's what's bugging me. For that holy bastard to be using that kind of alchemy. I'm telling you, it isn't alchemy. Why won't either of you believe that we're seeing true miracles? Brother, could it be? I ain't gonna lie, buddy boy in the back got socks on, bro. <laughs> he ain't got those shoes. And he got his arms crossed with the socks. That's how you coming out, my boy? That's tough. Yeah, it could. Jackpot. Uh, excuse me? You know what, Rose? I'm really interested in this religion now. And I'd sure like to meet the prophet in person. Could you be kind enough to guide us to where he is, please? Oh, so I finally converted you? Yes, of course. I will gladly take you to him. He's a very busy man. You should consider yourselves lucky. Is your broke ass so. We appreciate it. I promise it won't take long. Yes, I know. It will all be over in a second. Just, Just like, like this. this. Yeah, you can tell. That was a fail. Be all right. Father Cornello gave the word. The hammer of God has fallen on these heretics. It is Leto's will. Wow, your god is mean. Hmm? Who's there? Is a demon and shit. This is my punishment for setting foot on Holy Girl. We made a mistake, and we're paying for it. Both of us are. Edward, oh, you freak! Kill them! Kill both of them! Well, if the cat ain't finally out of the bag, let's get him out! So there's your god at work. No! This must be some mistake! Father Cornello couldn't possibly give such orders! Father Cornello is a compassionate man! He reached out to me and saved me when I became alone in this world. And Father promised me that he will bring Cain, my love, back to life. He promised me! Ah, for crying out loud. You see all this and you still want to believe in your fake prophet. But... 
Rose, do you have the courage to see the truth? <laughs> okay, I'm ready, Ed. All right. There's got to be a way to go farther into the temple. Let's look around. That's a safe right there. Yeah! <laughs> 
Zod. Where'd all the henchmen go? Whoa. Wait a minute, Ed. Look at those up there. I think it's some sort of booby trap. Wow. The Prophet must be keeping some hardcore secrets in here. Let's see what I can do. Sitting down for bro. We got dudes to beat up and shit. You better get your ass up. You know, tea time and shit. We in the field with it. I guess. What do we do? It doesn't look like we can beat those things through normal attacks. They do look hard, but they're also on the slow side. We'll just have to use that to our advantage. to do that counter. I thought it would be a smaller window. Ah, man. It won't be easy fighting them one by one. Yeah, I'll use alchemy to finish them off. Huh! 
Funny smell. Something sweet and sour. Smell? A puddle. It's not like it's raining outside, or the maid's been cleaning the temple hallways. I don't know. And another thing, doesn't it feel like someone's watching us? Now you've got me paranoid. like that before. They obviously weren't human, but they weren't any sort of animal. Could they have been a product of the Philosopher's Stone too? That must be it. Cornello must have made those inky black monsters. And I hate tasteless transmutations. But tasteless transmutations are your forte. Well, we can clear that up when we meet Cornello. Let's hurry out. chat with the Grand High Windbag himself. Now be on your best behavior, Ed. We should watch his moves and... I know, I know. He is the prophet after all. I'll be good. When did 
That's Miliotis actor from Seven Deadly Sins. Kind of sounds like Miliotis. Welcome to our sacred temple. What could a state alchemist want here? Have you come to hear a sermon? I don't have time for sermons from a con man. Your ring, it's the Philosopher's Stone, isn't it? Let me put this as simply as possible. Hand it over! Ed, I thought you said you'd be good. Hmm. So the state alchemist sees through everything, indeed. The legendary alchemic amplifier is in my hands. We've been searching for ages. We'll keep quiet about your swindles if you hand over the stone, so... <laughs> that is utterly absurd! Those citizens are my faithful servants. Do you think they'll listen to you? <laughs> Spare me the self-righteousness. Now I'm starting to feel sorry for all the people who believe in you. The believers do not even realize that the miracles are nothing but alchemy. No need to sympathize with such fools. The only use I have for them is merely as pawns for war. Father! Is that... is that true? Oh, shit. What? Rose, w where did you come? Uh, how? For merely war, father, how could you? Are you saying that you're not going to grant me my wishes through your miracles? Is Cain not coming back from the dead? True, I am not a commissary of God, but with this stone, I may have the power to revive your fallen love. Rose, don't listen to him! Rose, be a good girl and come to me. I am the only one who can make your wish come true. Remember, Cain? Now come! Who threaten my order? Oh shit, let me sit up. This is looking like a boss fight. We about to end it right here. Cornello. <laughs> oh, this one's a TV show. Quite a powerful stone, as you should well know, boy. For instance, I can easily forge something like this. A chimera. Go get them, my beast. Rip them to pieces. Try to bring a human back to life. When you 
cross into God's territory, or whatever the hell it is. Mechanical limbs. Your auto mail. I see. Now I understand you, Mel. You are the full metal. The full metal alchemist. Man, to watch this show. I go, 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 I well, that does answer a riddle of mine. Why the military would give a pup like you such a stern name. Full Metal. Full Metal. See, Rose, these miserable boys dabbled with the most forbidden taboo in alchemy, human transmutation. I lost my entire body while Ed lost his left Why is it glitching, bro? The other side? This shit is annoying. With his left leg gone, Ed transmuted my soul and bound it to this suit of armor, sacrificing his right arm. <sighs> the two of us try to revive one dead person, and look at us now. Rose, this is what happens when you try to bring back what's dead. Do you really want to go through with that? Rose, you panicking. I ain't gonna let you out of TP. <laughs> oh, silence! Just shut your mouths! You are simply a sorry pair who stepped on the toes of God and were rejected! This time, I'll make sure you fools pay Leto a permanent visit. Miss them, my chimera! Alright, it's time for war. Let's go. Lance transmutation. focus on me the whole time like can he fight alpha bro all right bro i'm just gonna let alpha do the work this is why i'm about to max out his strength bro because he's gonna be focused on me the whole time i'm just gonna run around in circles Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, that's the better, I ain't gonna lie. That's the better, bro. Like, bro, I can't even get inside the pocket. Like, he's focusing on me. Like, that shit crazy. I ain't gonna lie, yeah. Alphonse, max out his strength off rip. How, how could my Chimera be defeated? Oh, you snotty brats are such a pain! I can't believe what you said. How much 
you had to sacrifice to transmute a life. The basis of alchemy is equivalent exchange. In order to gain something, you have to pay the equivalent price. Both of you have paid a hefty price. You must have gotten your... Our mom was so nice. She was the best. We just wanted to see mom's face again. See her smile. Just one more time. was a failure. The mom that we transmuted didn't look like a human being. We've given up on bringing her back, but Ed still wants to get my body back the way it was before. I want to get Ed's body back too, but even that's a risk that could cost us our lives. This thorny path of life is our fate. So you see, Rose, this path is not for you to follow. Um. Cornello, not one person is allowed to pass beyond this point. We are the shield of the sun god. We shall not. Did you hear that, Ed? What are we going to do? Ever heard of bowling, Al? Huh? Bowling? So, you're not gonna budge, huh? Well, I've got two tons of steel that's about to say otherwise.
want me to do with the... Where'd she go? Please, stop him. I beg you. What the hell was that? We weren't hallucinating, were we? No. It was the real thing. I've got the proof right here in my hand. She sure was pretty. What could this ring be? Do you think this is the same ring as Cornello's? The one fitted with the Philosopher's Stone? I don't think so. This isn't the Philosopher's Stone. I don't feel any power of the sort. Oh, too bad. But I guess that would have been too easy. Not that this is any old ring. The pattern inside the gem looks like a transmutation circle. See? Wow, you're right. I wonder what it's for. Ugh, what are we doing? We still have to find the prophet. Yeah, let's look at this ring later. Let's go, Al. open. Did he go this way? But we don't want to end up outside in the plaza. Unless he ditched the temple to go outside. Nah, he's not the type of guy to just turn tail. He's gotta be planning some kind of dirty trick. But it's no trick when you see it coming a mile away. He's got no idea who he's dealing with. The statues are even bigger! <laughs> Do you understand my power now? Not even a state alchemist could top the power I possess. Now you will die, and I shall become God himself! You couldn't do a damn thing without the stone, you third-rate swindler! I'm gonna crush you and your delusions to pieces!
Not to be a heathen or anything, but I'd say your god's batting 0 for 2. Uh, you won't get... Get your ass down here, you crook. I'm gonna show you that I'm way out of your league. Cocky little brat. I'm going to kill you! Let me get back, let me get back. Rage attacks. So I want a circle. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Um, I'm good. I'm good. I don't need all that. Oh yeah. How you do this raid shit? Just focus on me, bro. Like, how's it not activated? You, you fool! Teamwork. Uh, 
I told you, I'm way out of your league. I won't. I won't give up. As long as I have the stone, I can uh, make as many miracles as... What? Ah! I like my dick. Damn, I am like, what the fuck was I supposed my to do? My arm! My arm! Shut up, it's just a rebound! What's the big deal if you lose an arm or two? Just let me see the stone! The stone! It shattered. <sighs> the Philosopher's Stone's supposed to be flawless. How could it ever break? Could this be an imitation? You mean, the stone was fake? Yeah, a fake. Just another wild goose chase. And here I thought we could finally put you back in the flesh again. No, brother. You'll be the first we'll fix. That auto mail's so tough on you. <sighs> Nothing left to do, but start the search again. You never should have come here. Father Cornello gave us hope. What right did you have to take that away? Rose. What do I have to live for, huh? Now that I know Cain won't come back, you tell me that, Ed! You'll have to decide for yourself. Walk on your own. Move forward. You've got a good, strong pair of legs, Rose. You should get up and use them. his hands on it. Hmm. Good question. I guess we could go back and drag it out of him.
It's been a while since we were here at East City. Well, there's no reason to come here, unless they drag us in for some reason or other. But it's rare for us to get a summons from the Colonel himself. I wonder what's up. That's probably about Lior. I might have gone a little overboard with that one. A little? That was way overboard, Ed. Oh well, I guess we'll face our fate soon enough once we get to East Headquarters. vehicle. Ed, look, that guy over there. Right, the street becomes a war zone and he doesn't even blink. What's wrong with this picture? Do you think he did it? There's only one way to find out. Come on, Al. We're going after him. Make sure we get all the chests in the area. for you. Did you see a suspicious looking guy walk through here? A suspicious looking? Come on, we ain't got time to play your stupid kitty spy games. Take a hike. Please, he had a patch over his right eye. We're pretty positive he came this way. And we've got reason to believe he just blew up a military car. Are these weenies after bald? Come again? I didn't quite catch that incriminating mumble. Ah, I hate to do this, but this is what you get for sticking your noses in where they don't belong. Whoa! Ed, these guys are armed! First a car bomb, now a shootout. I swear, I'm gonna write a very strong letter to HQ about this. Sorry, Pipsqueak, but it's time for you to get a whooping. Pip no hard squeak. feelings, eh? Nah, that's crazy. Who are these guys, and why are they so eager to fill us with lead? Maybe they're working with the eye patch guy, some kind of rebel group. What should we do with them? Screw them. They'll be out cold for a while. We gotta find our mark. He's bound to be close. Ow! Ow! 
have here? A manhole. Looks like it leads to the sewers. You think he went down there? It's what my money's on. Well, down the hatch we go. Maybe we can still catch up with him. Uh, okay. So as we go. Down here smells like something died multiple times. And it's human too. I can already feel the rust creeping over me. Don't worry, I'll polish your armor up nice and shiny once. Huh? Al, over there. Looks like our hunch was right. Come on, we don't want to lose him. seeing anything that we could transmute into a bridge. Fate's got it in for us today. I guess we don't have any other choice but to go back and find another way. Personnel only. Ah, oh, good. That must mean I'm allowed to go in. What could you possibly be authorized for? Just think of the thousands of gallons of water rushing through there.
Are you trying to make me want to go to the bathroom, Alphonse? Wait a minute. You know, Al, maybe if we can shut those gates, we can stop the water flow and... Yeah, then we can cross over to the other side of that channel back near the entrance. So the burning question is, how do we get those gates to close? <laughs> Who the hell are these sewer rats? Hey, where'd you punks come from? And how'd you get this far in? Ah, perfect timing. Hey, Pops, how can I get those floodgates to close? You got the gall to ask us? This ain't a place for brats like you. Get ready for a beating. <laughs> Fights the tents, I ain't gonna lie. Ah, how can that little microbe have so much moxie in him? I think this console controls the floodgates. Hmm, let's see. I'll take an educated guess and start pulling levers until something happens. Eeny, meeny, meeny. fix it up with alchemy? I don't think so. It looks like a few crucial parts fell through the grate and were washed away. Oh, man. Well, in that case, I guess it's up to me. I'm almost afraid to ask, but what are you going to do? Piece Canon and D. Am I awesome or what? Awesome? Are you crazy, Ed? What were you going to do if the sewers came crashing down on us? Huh? Oh, uh, well, I. Oh, come on, Al, loosen up. I stopped the water, didn't I? That's not the issue here. I swear. You have a short fuse and a short temper, and you're so short sighted. 
short, short, short! Can you be a little more repetitive, Alphonse? I'm not getting through, am I? Well, now we should be able to cross over that channel. As they say, all's well that ends well. That's for sewer. <laughs> Shake a leg, Al. We don't want to let that guy get too far ahead. What? Wait! I'm not done talking to you! stop right here thank you for watching don't forget to leave a like subscribe if you're new and i'm gonna see y'all in the next part man peace